good morning good morning and welcome into my channel well we are sitting here at the dock we are getting unloaded in red deer alberta right now and still don't have a reload yet but uh hey guess what the flying j is just down the road and i set my laptop up here and we are uploading a uh, tomorrow's video yeah so uh, luckily we are close enough to the flying j that the uh, wi-fi actually reaches up to here just barely but it does so we are hoping that we can get our video uploaded here soon you know by the time that they finish unloading me here that Either that or by the time I get me a reload that we should be uh, done unloading here. So uh, we'll keep our fingers crossed. Sun is shining today. We're getting unloaded. And we should be able to get a reload today. And if we do, we will make our way home. Because that's what I told this patch that I want to do. And then I should be home tomorrow night. That's the plan. So I guess we'll stick around here for a bit and see what uh, what we're going to get and how long it's going to take him to get me unloaded here. So it looked like it's going to take him a while because it's all kinds of parts and they're laying on the on the on the trailer and stuff. Not everything is on pallets, so some of it is going to have to get unloaded by hand. So that's probably going to take him a while to get me unloaded here. Probably an hour, hour and a half, maybe even two hours. So. That'll be okay though, because that way I can upload my video here and we'll be able to have a video again tomorrow, so. Alright, we'll be back in a bit. Well, we are coming into Calgary right now. We finished doing our delivery up there. Dispatch told me to uh, head back to Calgary. Keep to the left on Highway 201. And uh, drop this trailer at the uh, Calgary Terminal and then go to a customer and uh, pick up a preloaded trailer and then we'll be going to Brandon, do one drop up there and then uh, go to Winnipeg and drop the trailer there at a different customer and then we shall be going home yep, so we should be home for the weekend yeah, this is a uh, 201 highway it's a uh, a new highway that Calgary has built around Calgary. It's basically a bypass around Calgary, which was much needed too. Uh, Calgary never really had a bypass to go around Calgary, and this is uh, very good. At least now you don't have to go through downtown Calgary anymore just to go through Calgary, you know. I don't know how far it's done on the south side of Calgary yet, but it is uh, definitely done on the north part of Calgary. And I'm pretty sure eventually they will they'll be done in the south side of Calgary too with the bypass. For 16 kilometers. So for those of you that haven't been in Calgary in a long time, this is what you can expect and it's uh, called Stony Trail. Highway 201, that's what it's called. It's a bypass around Calgary. Uh, yep. Now we are about 23 kilometers away from my uh, yard terminal. And then we gotta come back into Calgary and pick up our load. back home eventually but uh, we will be doing a drop in Brandon first and then we'll be dropping the trailer in, uh, in Winnipeg yep and it's beautiful out here today it's nice and warm Calgary was nine degrees Celsius today that is almost you know I don't know record-breaking but that is pretty warm for in winter time. 
Yeah. The snow was definitely melting in there, that's for sure. But the sun is shining, everything is good, right? Dry roads now. Privates are good. Well, right in Calgary it was a bit messy, but up here it's good. Yep. Alrighty. We just had ourselves a little bit of a pit stop up here in uh, Madison, Alberta. Yeah. Now I need to figure out how to get out of here. Actually, I've never been here before uh, at this uh, particular truck stop. So now we need to figure out how we get out of here, right? Actually, I should have cleaned my lights up there, but I didn't. I was thinking more about food than anything else. Because I was hungry. And I grabbed me a AMW sandwich. And now we're going to put the hammer down. See how far we can make it today. It's just about to get dark, so... Uh, I guess we won't be doing much filming anymore left today, so uh, anyways, we'll put the hammer down and we will see you at the other end. Alrighty, we have made it as far as Cairnport, Saskatchewan. We are probably about an hour, an hour and 15 minutes away from Regina. And uh, I only had about half an hour left on my logbook, so uh, I figured I'd stop up here, call it a day. We have had a very long day behind us. I've been up since uh, early this morning, early enough anyways. And it is uh, almost 11 o'clock, I got here about 10.43 p.m. so it is time to call it a day I normally don't drive this late and uh, plus I uh, got a trailer with a, a heater unit on it it's not a reefer but it is a heater unit and it's running all right now so uh, yeah that's gonna be a little noisy there but Hey, that's all right. We'll we'll be okay. Anyways, I'm gonna make this short and sweet. So uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. And uh, hey, if you liked it, somebody else did probably too. Would probably like it too. So uh, share that video and click that like button if you liked it. And uh, give me comments down below if you have any questions. Any kind of comments, whatever, anything is welcome. So with that, have a good rest of the day, and we will see you again tomorrow at 5 a.m. So thanks for watching. Yeah.